Today, several civil rights groups are releasing a list of demands as part of the collaborative refresh. Reporter Whitney Miller joins us now live to explain. Whitney. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm here at City Hall. A lot of people in this crowd have just showed up here. They were chanting the names of George Floyd and Breonna Taylor. And that discussion kind of centers around uh, some of those people that we mentioned here and the discussion should get underway here soon but the Cincinnati Black United Front and the Ohio Justice and Policy Center and other groups will be the ones reading a list of demands uh, that's supposed to start at 530 but it looks like they might be getting started now now that this crowd has has shown up already the goal of the changes that they're asking for is to take a closer look at the systems in place today that promote systematic and institutionalized racism and they say those changes go beyond beyond police reform. They wanted to talk about affordable housing, about health care equality. Uh, so it's not just about issues with uh, concerning the police. Mayor Cranley, he also got wind of these changes earlier, and he has sent a letter uh, to the leaders of these uh, of, of this event here today uh, to invite them to start that discussion. Um, he says he's open to having discussions with single groups, with groups combined, and he wants to discuss how they can make some of these changes happen. Um, so he says, obviously, though, they need to be reviewed. We're going to check in and listen uh, into what those demands are, and we'll be bringing you a report throughout the evening. For now, at City Hall, Whitney Miller, WCPO 9 News.